are some things that you can do to increase upper body flexibility for weightlifting. The two places where you usually see a lack of upper body flexibility affect a weightlifter the most are in the catch of the snatch and the, ca and the rack position of the clean and jerk. This first exercise is for the catch and the snatch. And all, it's very simple. All we're going to have John do is take a wide grip on a broomstick. It's best to do this with something light, not a bar. It needs to be PVC or, or a, a, a wooden uh, rod or something like that, something that's very light. And he's simply going to take that bar over his head and attempt to touch his lower back with it. So go ahead, all the way over and down. Now back over to the front. Once you've done it wide, move your grip in just a little bit on each side. Okay? Repeat. All the way over. Back and around. Good. Move your grip in a little more. Go. Back around. As you can see, it's getting harder and harder the further he moves his grip in. Let's try one more, just a little bit more. pretty hard to get back around. The process of gaining the shoulder mobility and flexibility in order to catch a snatch in a good upright position and hold the bar behind your head like you're supposed to, simply a process of moving your hands closer and closer and closer on this exercise until if you're having a lot of trouble and your hands are here and here, by the time you get them in here where John has them now, you're going to be much, much better off. It doesn't take too long to progress on this exercise. Uh, most people can get their hands six inches further in. On a, on a PVC pipe uh, within a week or two. Okay, let's put that down. The next thing we're going to do is work on a, a flexibility for the rack position in the clean. And I'm going to have John just take an empty bar here in a rack, and he's going to come around like he's fixing to lift it off for a front squat. Not going to lift the bar up, actually. He's just going to get in that position. Then a partner is going to come in, put your hands right outside of his, Duck down to where his elbows are on top of your shoulders, and then push the bar down and push his elbows up at the same time. Okay? I'm going to go ahead and do that one more time just so you can see exactly what I'm doing. Go ahead and, like you're going to lift it off, I come in, I grab the bar here, put his elbows on top of my shoulders, and now I stand up and push down on the bar. Okay? I go as, until I feel a lot of resistance and I kind of see that some pain in his eyes. Hold it there for a minute. And then let that down. Okay. I will warn you that that one hurts. Okay. Don't get too carried away with it. You have to have your partner has to uh, definitely give you some feedback. But that is the best stretch that I've ever seen in order to take somebody who has a real hard trouble uh, getting the bar onto their shoulders, uh, getting the elbows up, or achieving a good rack position. That stretch will fix it in a fairly short amount of time.